Well, I think we've had a, we've had a, a very kind of serendipitous uh, uh, um, uh, chain of events because it was the 65th anniversary of, uh, of the airfield here, and we've been trying for about the last nine months to see if the Red Arrows would come come along and, and, and do a display here in honor of the of the uh, airmen from the uh, Second World War. So they just agreed to do that, and then we were at the same time out in California trying to uh, break the land speed record for steam vehicles, which has stood for 103 years. But this is kind of a, a dual uh, uh, event. It's, uh, it's honoring the, uh, the people that, uh, that, that kept this country free uh, 65 years ago and also um, you know, with the technology and encouraging, hopefully, engineers and students to keep, uh, keep studying and keep trying. And I'm sure the, the group of students, whatever it was, 11 years ago at uh, Southampton University never kind of really dreamed that their car would be actually become one day a reality, even if it's in a different kind of form. But certainly we've shown that uh, steam's still a viable motive force. Uh, you know, a new world record that, who knows, might stand for another 103 years.